Yeah, welcome to the show. I'm reading the email. It says, help. This is my problem. I'll make it short. For social gatherings, I'm pretty dull to be around. I don't feel confident, don't talk much, don't have guts to approach women. Uh, when Wama approach me, I think you want to say women approach me sometimes, I can't find words to say back, so I end up with awkward situations. But I found a cure for all this, alcohol. When I'm pretty tipsy slash drunk, drunk <clears throat> it solves all my problems. My fear is gone. I'll be flirting with girls, doing some wild shit that impresses people. But I don't want to have to carry a bottle of rum every time I want to go out. I don't want to end up an alcoholic. What do you think I should do? And the problem is you. You put yourself in a situation where you're being shy and quiet. You create that persona. And now it's time to start tearing it down. What you want to start doing is the exact same thing I did. I was like that in high school. I'd have a drink before I could talk to a girl and stuff like that. And I was heading towards uh, early alcoholism myself. I started drinking in the ninth grade, eighth and ninth grade, but mostly to escape the misery of my life. Uh, but I noticed the alcohol gave me courage. And I'm glad I woke up and realized that was a bad path to go down. So what you got to do is you got to do it one step at a time. And that is learn to start socializing with girls. Learn to have a real uh, conversation with them. What I want you to do is, um, let's first of all, get you to do what I call walk the 50. That means you've got to count them out, 50 different women. Walk up and say hello or say something to them to acknowledge their existence, how you're doing, how you're feeling, or whatever. And then I want you to walk away. Don't try to pick them up. Don't try to get numbers. Don't try to hold a conversation. I just want you to do just that one thing. 50 of them. Next 50. So you got, you got quite a few hundred to do. Next 50, what I want you to do is before you approach them, find something nice about them. Okay? Something that you like. Uh, maybe their hair looks nice. Uh, maybe they have a pretty face. I want you to walk over Tell them what you, what you think is nice about them. Hey, you know, I just noticed that you've got really nice eyes. And then turn around, walk away. Don't try to hold a conversation with them. Don't try to pick them up. Don't try to get their number. Okay? This is training. This is boot camp training. Next, 50. 50 different girls, preferably the ones you haven't approached yet. Walk over. Uh, say your introduction, say hello. And I want you to say, uh, after that, I want you to uh, give, them that give them an honest compliment and then try to talk for one minute. I want you to learn to use your creative mind. I see you're a boxer, so you should be able to flow. Just like you're boxing, you know, you flow with the movements. So you should be able to flow with the conversation. Try to hold the conversation for up to a minute. It doesn't matter. Just get a couple of words out of your mouth, then tell them to have a good day and walk away. Okay? So after the compliment, you want to carry the compliment on a little bit further, basically, and say a few more words. And your conversation can last up to a minute. Just try to make it for 15, 20 seconds. doesn't matter. You know, ask them what their name is or whatever, and then introduce yourself and then say have a nice day and then walk away. It's that simple. Okay? Now your next 50 it's going to it's going to stretch you. It's going to make you get over your bullshit cuz what you're doing to yourself is bullshit. You don't feel confident, you don't talk much, you don't have the guts to approach women. That's bullshit. You don't sold yourself. So we got to get you to get over yourself. It, it really is that like that. I was like that myself. So I had to learn how to get over myself. If you get, can catch my tone of using that phrase, get over myself. You know, I was, 
I was being shy. And when people are shy, that's a form of vanity. You think the whole world revolves around. You think people are staring at you and they're judging you and all that stuff. Like you mentioned, you're afraid they're judging you or you want to impress people. You know, that's the same part of the same bullshit. You ain't got to impress nobody. The more, the less you impress, the more you impress, brother. So I want you to walk up to the next 50, 50 girls. I don't know if you how old you are, but if you remember Eddie Murphy, go find Eddie Murphy's stand-up routine called Raw or something like that. And he says the word Goonie Goo Goo. That's your challenge. I want you to walk up to 50 different women and say Goonie Goo Goo. This is my hardest exercise. Very few people have actually gotten over this exercise and accomplished it. After Goonie Goo Goo, She's going to say, what? I want you to use your creative imagination and your creative mind to create an, a way out of that. So basically, this is almost like improv acting that I did when I was in college. You know, I had to go up to people and say something, some gibberish to them, you know, all over campus and you know, make a fool of myself. And it's helped me get, get over myself. So I want you to go up to 50 different girls and say, Goony Goo Goo. Okay? Then try to hold a conversation with them after that. That will develop your, your ability to conversate and also recover real fast. By the time you get the 50 of those, you will be ready and you'll be over this bullshit. All right? Good luck to you, fella.